been something very special indeed here. He goes through the arches in just outside it will be two hours. 201.39 is the target. He's going to smash the world record under the famous arches of the Brandenburg Gate built in 1791. And from here, 352 metres to go. Less than 60, 60 seconds of running. It's less than a lap of the track. All those early starts, all those endurance runs, the tempo runs, the sacrifices that he's made have all come down to this. His wife and children are watching back home in Kenya. The crowds are going crazy. It's history unfolding here on the streets of Berlin in the sunshine. The double Olympic champion is the greatest marathon runner we have ever seen in the history of the event. He's going to get inside the world record. It won't be by a minute, but it will be an appreciable chunk. He has done it again. This is superhuman. This is road running from a different planet here in Berlin in 2022. Elliot Kipchoge smiles for the last time. Let's keep an eye on the clock just outside 201. Elliot Kipchoge is a history maker in Berlin. Yet again, he has done it. The world record is gone, and now he can celebrate. And that is simply stunning. A warm embrace from Patrick Sang, his long-term coach. And the greatest marathon runner the world has ever seen has produced the fastest marathon the world has ever seen. This man leaves you scrambling for superlatives again and again. Why did we ever doubt him? There have even been whisperings from one or two people who claim to have been in the know in the last few days that the world record would not go today. Well, more fool them, more fool us for giving any credibility to those opinions. Because Elliot Kipchoge knew. He knew all along, didn't he?